My name is Alexander Canaris, and I'm part of the research and development group at VDG. VDG is a manufacturer of uh, drum motors, as we have, was, as we look at one uh, here, and we have uh, two locations: in United States, one location in Brampton, Ontario, rather, and one location in Amsterdam, in Holland. So. A little bit about the design that we have is the uh, drum motor is uh, it has all the components, external components, usually they be used on a conveyor, motor and gearbox, chain sprockets, everything is inside the, uh, the roller. So what we have, we, uh, we're looking here, this is the, where we make all the electrical connections. The electrical wires they trans through and they go the connect into the motor stator. We achieve rotation on the rotor and then we have a two-stage gear reduction unit. So we don't have any rotating components, no bearings uh, to be uh, greased or to be, uh, be repaired. So we don't, we don't have any of that. So it's, uh, it's using aggregate and mining application, a very dusty application without the environment to interfere with the, um, uh, with the internal operation of the components of the drum drive. So, the uh, drum drives, they have been around since uh, 1985, but uh, we really, up to this point, the drum drives really did not have a big success in those industries, primarily for reasons of uh, te uh, temperatures. As we can see, we don't have a cooling fan, we don't have uh, 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 any other uh, equipment inside to, um, uh, to keep the electric motor cool, so they were somehow not very reliable equipment to use. So a few years back we have uh, uh, incorporated different designs in our drum motors and we did a lot of studies and we spent a lot of money on research and development. So what we see here, we see one of the most reliable drives in the market today and we have what we uh, uh, what we call an oil cooler in order to address the temperature rise inside the drum motor so what we have we have an oil cooler we, which we extract the oil from the drum we filter it cool it and then put it back uh, into the motor and uh, of course you know we are we have in the manifold where we direct the oil to be uh, specifically to locations that they need to be to be lubricated on the uh, electric motor. So uh, by addressing the temperature issues, which is uh, uh, that uh, has been uh, a work in progress for us for about uh, almost eight years now, uh, we have went from a not so reliable product to the most reliable product today in the industry and that is the BTG drum motor.